Outlaw Roadies. So it is day two of the road trip. I uh, hope you guys are having a good Friday. It's Friday the 13th. Um, today is going pretty well. I'll be honest and tell you guys that it's like 1 p.m. I know it's late for a first vlog, but I watched the Green Hornet this morning and was busy just doing some other things, editing yesterday's vlog and stuff, and just never got around to filming a video. For breakfast, I had oatmeal. For lunch, I just had a ham sandwich. I am dressed and ready to go to the gym, so we're going to go do that in a few minutes. Um, but in my last video, I said I had epiphany, so let me tell you my epiphany. I was on the treadmill yesterday, and I was thinking, um, I get really, like, caught up in things and foods that are considered bad or you know foods that are considered not the right choice for health wise so my epiphany was that it's really it really doesn't depend on that you know what I mean like it really is about portion control and moderation so that's what I'm going to focus on now because if I tell myself Jen you're not going to have um no you know bad food anytime soon the second I have the bad food just like the last time the second I had something I shouldn't have had on Easter Sunday it was like a free-for-all and I kind of like freaked out and didn't know how to get back on control and now that I'm back on control um it's time to focus on that you know and focus on moderation and um and portion control so you know if I want let's just say for example if I want a Big Mac and fry you know, get the Big Mac and fry, but cut it in half and share it with somebody. Portion control. Not say, and then don't have a Big Mac every single day. Maybe like once a month. Once every other month. Something like that. You know, if there's 21 meals in a week, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, if I choose one of those meals to, um, you know, eat something that maybe, like, splurge a little bit, so be it. You know, because now I've incorporated working out every day into my routine. So what is, uh, you know, a... Uh, non-healthy meal I guess you would say I'm not even gonna call it a cheat meal because it's really not cheating because you have to incorporate those kind of foods in your daily life you know or not your daily life but in your you know your lifestyle should I say so there's my epiphany what do you guys think I shared it with Julie this morning she really um, you know she was really happy that I come to that all about myself today or yesterday so so yeah there was my uh, epiphany let me know what you guys think about that. I'm off to the gym, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, Rodies, it's like 3.30. Just leaving the gym. Did like 45 minutes of cardio. And now it's off to home. Home, home, home on the rain. Where are the deer in the antelope? Oh, okay, enough of that, enough of that. Um, so yeah, don't know, don't know what's for dinner just yet. But that will be uh, the next agenda. What's for dinner at your house? Or by the time you've seen it, what was for dinner at your house? I don't know. Oh my god, do you smell that? Oh. See? Yeah. See? It's like no matter where I drive, and in a minute, I'm going to pass Kentucky Fried Chicken. I think we live chicken. in the fast food capital of the world. <laughs> we must. We must live in the fast food capital of the world. Look at Eric Queen. But good workout today, roadies. Heck yeah. Day two is off to a great, great start. Yes. Alright, roadies. Until later on. Bye! Bye! Backseat. <laughs> Backseat. When I first heard this song, no joke, I'm not saying this for camera's sake. I thought she said so I can be your panty dropper. And that means that. No, I'm serious. <laughs> so I thought she said, next time you guys hear that song on the radio, sing this lyrics. Hopefully your mom's in the car. <laughs> like my mom does. Oh, I saw another one like Well, no, the first time I heard the song, I, that's what I thought it was. Sorry, I really like it. Rodies, what do you think? That's what I think. Cool, cool. So it's 7.30 now, and I've actually been a lazy bum on the couch for the last few hours after the gym. Yeah, didn't really do much. Um, 
Now I'm leaving my house with my uh, sister and my mom to go and get something to eat because we did not cook nothing tonight. Because usually we don't on Friday nights. And here comes part of my, well it ain't even a dilemma because and whatever I eat, I eat, no big deal. But um, I'll keep you guys posted and see to see what I get for dinner. Because I'm really not feeling nothing like greasy or nothing, so I'll keep you guys posted. Oh, I'm roadies. It's like 9.15 at night, and I got home from dinner, and you'll be really happy and proud to know that even with all the um, fast food nearby, I honestly just did not want that tonight. Like, I just didn't want nothing really greasy or uh, a lot of calories. I just wasn't really feeling that tonight. Um... So, I went to Boston Market, and they have, like, meals under 550 calories. So, I had um, the three-piece dark chicken meat, which is, like, a thigh and, like, two drumsticks. And I took the skin off of it. And then I had zucchini and the garlic dill potato wedges, which were, like, the, they were, like, the two healthiest choices on the sides. And all together, it was under 550 calories. Not bad at all. Um, so I was really happy with that. So I did pretty good today food-wise. I had uh, breakfast at oatmeal, lunch I had a ham sandwich, and for dinner I had Boston Market. So that was pretty good. Um, uh, and snack, I had like two apples throughout the day, coming back and forth from the gym and stuff. Um, I'm ending this kind of early tonight because I'm getting up in the morning at like 6.30 to go to the gym. So I'm going to, um take a shower and just kind of get ready for bed and stuff because I don't want to um, go to bed too late tonight. So I'm ending it kind of early, but I did want to do like a, a good night video to you guys. Um, day two of the road trip is done. So we're working our way slowly but surely to South Bend, Indiana. Um, with that said, my new mentality, I hope you guys um, give me some feedback on it. What do you guys think? Um, I said it earlier in today's vlog. Um, about, you know, eating and proportion and, and uh, moderation and stuff like that. So if you can give me some feedback on that, I would really, really appreciate it. And as always, roadies, thank you very much for all your support. I do appreciate it. It means the world to me that you guys support me every single day and you guys watch my videos. I try to watch as many videos as possible. I will be honest and tell you that there are just some videos I just, you know, I, it takes like the weekend for me to catch up and watch them and stuff. Um, but I, I plan on doing that tomorrow, watching some more videos. And, yeah, that's about how my day went. Um, tomorrow, Saturday, no really big plans. Sunday, I'm um, going out to dinner with the family. But we're going to a restaurant called Bahama Breeze. And I've already looked at the menu, and I found, like, the best, what to eat, the best thing. And it's fish tacos. And there's really nothing, you know a lot of calories here at this this restaurant is all like grilled and it has like citrus like you know dressings and stuff so we're gonna give that a shot and we're gonna go see um i think bridesmaids or something borrowed one of them too we're gonna go see it so that's how my weekend's gonna go i hope you guys have a i hope you guys have had a good day and if you don't tune in over the weekend have a good weekend and i'll see you guys next week and if you do tune in over the weekend i'll see you guys manana have a good night, roadies. Bye.